Hello, if you're clicking on this video, you're interested in my journey with the Belleville University Doctor of Business Administration program. My name is Jeremy and I am currently enrolled in the program. Today is January 24th, 2024, and it's been quite some time since I have made a video. That should give you an indication of uh, how busy I am with just being a human being, working full time in school. Um, I am in year two, term two, which means that I have another two terms in the second year and another full year. So whew, it's a lot. Um, the classes that I've gone through, the residency, and this is all online, residency, business and society, leadership in global organizations, human capital, development, doctoral research project one, organizational communication, applied research, um, and I'm currently in Applied Research 2 and Doctoral Research Pro Project Part A. Mouthful, right? By far, this has been the most challenging part of the program because we are talking about qualitative uh, methods and we're starting to do the introduction literature review um, for the project that we're doing, the capstone or the dissertation, right? Um, this is a lot. It's doable. It's very challenging, but it, it, and it is a lot. Um, am I glad that I've gone through the program? Yes, my experience has been positive thus far. And I feel like I'm learning um, and growing in a way that I can see at work when I'm not tired <laughs> um, and in a way that allows me to better articulate just in general and be a better thinker or like critically evaluate the things that I receive on a daily basis, whether it's a normal conversation, whether it's about work, whether it's about politics, whether it's about any topic, right? There's always this extra step that I'm taking of reflecting on my experiences with the subject. And if I don't have experience with the subject, questioning what's out there about the subject and how that information was gathered and processed in a way that helps whatever that subject is have a certain uh, awareness around it, right? Um, it, I don't know how to articulate in a way that you would understand if you're not in the program, how much work goes into it. I will tell you that I work full time and I'm dedicating at least 20 hours um, per class um, to the reading and the uh, assignments. It's a lot. <laughs> and you have to be really, really self-motivated to get to the program. My professor experience has been good. Um, the won't let you just slide by with okay work like you will get called out in your grading and in the um feedback don't take it personal um but yeah you will get called out um i'm learning i i, I know that it's been quite some time since I've, I've done a video so i really don't have much context beyond um my current classes to update you on. So I hope that thus far, I think it's been like six months since I've done an, another video, but I hope uh, in the updates that I provided thus far, you have a, a really good idea of what the program is about. In, um, I alluded earlier in my current classes for applied research, it's really, really studying qualitative research, like the five different approaches, um, how to use those approaches, approaches, how to apply those approaches to your topic if you're doing qualitative research. It's just building that muscle of how to do qualitative research. And then the um, doctoral research project two, part A, is all about setting the foundation for the work that you're going to be doing, in my opinion, specifically with the research that's out there about your topics. So a lot of reading a lot of reading, a lot of reading, a lot of reading. 
Um, if you are a, a doctor of business administration student or an online student in general, what I hope you take away from this video is um, this particular program, this school that I'm going to in this program is well worth it thus far. Of course, I have my moments of, man, I don't want to do this anymore. Um, but the information that I've learned has been a great um, experience thus far. And I look forward to the remaining two terms and year uh, that I have left. Each class or each term is 10 weeks and you get a two week break in between. So that really helps. Um, this past break I didn't really use because I had changed my topic uh, um, and had to catch up on a lot of reading like a lot of reading but um yep so far so good and my next update will be a little bit more in depth um, but i just wanted to at least post this video so you didn't have a con uh, an additional month or so in between the updates that i'll continue to do going forward have a great one